I promise you guys, success is the loneliest road out there. It's you and your shadow at the end. Because it's too f***ing hard. People are not going to be around you to motivate you. They're not going to be around you to push you, to celebrate you, to applaud you. You got to do it on your own. It's hard to keep going when no one is supporting you, when no one is clapping for you. And that is exactly why you have to become your own biggest fan. You really do have to believe in yourself when no one else does. Always keep going. Always. No matter what happens, the storm eventually ends. And when the storm does end, you want to make sure that you're ready. Because eventually that storm passes. Don't judge your destiny by your history. Being a warrior is not about the act of fighting. It's about believing in something so strong that's worth fighting for that you'll never quit. You will never, ever quit because it means so much to you. My strength is in my struggle. The level of battle you face is an indication of the level of blessings that you stand to receive. If you're up under attack, there's something to be gained. Because people don't fight people who don't build. If you weren't building anything, nobody would battle you. If you weren't going forward, they wouldn't fight you. You want to make your dream come true, you got to stay focused. Some people rather get even than get ahead. Stay focused on where you want to go. Championships aren't won in the theater or the arena. They're won in the thousands of hours in the training room, in the lab and the 5 a.m. runs and it's rainy when everyone else is sleeping. That's when it's won. The Harvard champion is a light switch that's always on. It doesn't go on and off when someone's watching. It's constant. It's how you look at something. If your name's attached to it, then you do it right. The best of your ability every single time. How bad do you want it? Do you want it bad enough to keep turning back, to look at it again? I don't know what it means, but it's drawing me. And I don't know what's going to come out of it, but some kind of way, my destiny tied to that. And I can't walk away. Your destiny is in the fire. If you run from the fire, you will run from your destiny. Your destiny is in the problem. Your destiny is in the storm. Your destiny is in the fight. If you want to be a diamond, you must go through extreme pressure. If you can't take pressure, then you're not a diamond. After you go through all the pressure you thought you could not handle and you think it's over, then they turn on the heat. Once it goes through that type of pressure and it finally becomes a diamond, at that point you can't break it no more. I've been broken so much. I've been defeated so much. I've been disappointed so much in my life that I know what it feels like. I can't handle it. Once you get to that point, you cannot be broken anymore. I dare you to take another step. You're right on the verge of stepping into your purpose, into your destiny. If you don't give up, if you don't baby yourself, if you go ahead and push yourself and get on up out of this mess, your whole life is about to change. If you do what is easy, your life will be hard. But if you do what is hard, keep coming back again and again and again. Get up dressed every day, knowing some way, somehow, with a spirit of expectation, I can do this. If you do that over and over and over again, your life will be easy.